everybody. That word finds here. I'm Mary Beth. And I'm Laura. And Michelle's backstage as Hi, well. Hi, Michelle. <laughs> Michelle is like getting her bearings together. We're going to let her have her last couple bites of a sandwich. Yeah. <laughs> so if you're, if you're not sure what's happening, Michelle just finished up her sale and now she's going to come over here, sell a few items, and then Laura and I, if I'm available, <laughs> are going to sell some aprons. So I'm not going to be on here, though, the whole time. I've got some work to finish up. I thought you were really just kidding. <laughs> well, I'm still working. I've got to get back to work for a few minutes. Okay, Michelle's going to come on here with me. That's fine. Okay. So, yeah. I don't want to be on here by myself. I never know what's happening on your channel. <laughs> Thanks, Carrie. I love you, too. So, yeah. I'm going to go. You've got this. Oh, no. I have all the faith in the world. I'll just be like right behind that wall if you need me. Oh, dear. I've got to go do some work. Well, how do I put Michelle on? Okay, so look. You <laughs> just add Michelle to the stream. Okay. Watch this. It's going to be great. Okay. Are you oh, ready? Right. Yeah, she's smiling. She's ready. Boom. <laughs> there she is. Hi. There's my besties. Okay. Hi. Carrie says, Laura's going to be telling us the number before the price. Whatever, Carrie. You be nice to me. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, I'm gonna go back to work, but I'll I'll pop I'll pop it back on here okay. in a few minutes. Okay, that sounds good. Okay. Good luck, Laura. <laughs> Laura, you got this. We're good. We're good. Yeah. As, as long as at least she's here in the building, because I have no technical knowledge whatsoever. Plus, there's those cloud graphics that kind of like you know, like kind of take a little away from us, and and so we look a little better. And also, I'm closer, so I look like a big fat pumpkin head. <laughs> what are you closer to? You're closer the to your camera. camera. Oh, yeah. Okay, <laughs> let's see who all's in the chat. Love you guys. Yeah, I guess you all came over from Michelle's sale. Michelle, what all did you sell today? Um, I sold some collections. So I sold some or things that people collect. So I sold some fairy lamps. I sold some duck deer, some swans, some creamers. Restaurant wear, bibbies, whatever. Nice. Mm -hmm. Great job. Oh, I'm dressed fancy. This is my this is my work outfit. <laughs> so I had to work till two thirty. I so, can't yeah. see the chat because I am using my my tablet to uh, do some research while I'm 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 selling on the fly. Hey, you're gonna do great. I'm all right. My first one already is like a big one. <laughs> I knew it when I found it. Like it was not in the lot that I found, but I found it the other day and I was like, bam, it's a killer purse. You know what? Spoiler alert. You know what uh, Jeffrey found while we were out on our little shopping expedition? Well, uh, found Eden Collins. Yeah. But you know what? Did you know I bought one the other night? Did I tell you that? No. Yes, I did because I know I can't afford one at Jeffrey's sale. And I was at um, Traveling Button, you know, on Instagram. Uh, and uh, she and Marcy were having a sale. And I really like, I've always loved them. Um, like Enid Collins and Betsy Johnson. I just love a lot of their stuff, but I don't always think I can pull it off. And right. I know a lot of people are like, oh, come on, you could totally pull it off. But you know, you know how much alike we are in real life. We're like, you know, like I don't really need to be all seen. But when yeah. I'm here, I'm like, bam, see me. <laughs> so, well, no why, but yeah, I um things there, Michelle. Betsy Johnson. What? Betsy Johnson and Enid Collins, they're pretty opposite. They're kind of Yeah, but they're both very personality driven i feel like they're very cool and so i bought one the other night for 40 dollars, and i love it but 40 dollars, i was like dang i can do that hey that's awesome uh -huh. so you got it to, to wear yourself right uh, well i'm not gonna even i'm just gonna look at it in here <laughs> <laughs> you're just gonna set it up and look at it somewhere <laughs> yeah no. it's like a figurine <laughs> <laughs> oh that's funny it's my art <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you want to you want to take turns, right? You want to yeah, go back. If you want to, we can. Okay. All right, do like, I'll do a person, and you can do a couple aprons, whatever, whatever. Yeah. I don't have to sell a bunch. I'm just, I'm just the uh, icing on the cake. <laughs> ah, nice icing on the cake. Look at you. <laughs> I'm trying to read the chat and talk to you at the same time. Everybody's. <laughs> Chatting away here about their Enid Collin love. Oh, yeah. 
Okay, so I tried to make this easy today. I've got all kinds of aprons. If you guys remember, we have bought a box at the auction and it was only like $4. It said scarves and I was all excited and it had two or three not so pretty scarves on the top <laughs> when we picked it up. And I was like, oh no. But then after I took those off, it had all these aprons in there. So that was pretty exciting. And so we're just gonna sell everything, you know, whatever was in the box in $15 a piece. And then we're just gonna cool. do shipping for five bucks, no matter how many you buy. And that yeah, way, it'll, wow, that's awesome. Yeah, so look, I thought that would be fun. When you're ready to put the banner up there, just go here. <laughs> she heard me. No, I don't know, a banner and then where? So banner and it's this banner right here. Okay. So when you click on it, it'll go. Okay, there we go. Look, she's got me all fixed up. So yeah, you can click on that again when you want it to hide. Okay, great, thanks. So there you go. You can just leave it up for a minute. Well, you can put it back up. You can do it, I have faith in you. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> I know how to do it, I'll tell <laughs> Okay, so yes. So all the aprons are $15 a piece and then you're just only gonna pay one $5 shipping for however many you buy. And we're gonna pick up the rest of the shipping. So that'll be fun, right? That's awesome. Yeah. You guys are generous like that. I am not. <laughs> well, most of the time everybody pays for their shipping and it's really not a generosity thing. It's that time-wise, it helps me so much because I can just invoice. Yeah. Well, I can invoice. I think you're pretty organized with those aprons and they're easy to, you know, they're foldable, they're light. These yeah. purses, like one could weigh eight yeah. ounces and the other one could weigh five pounds. So Yeah, no, you would never be able to do that. Yeah, this is only doable when it's something little that's easy to fold yeah. and ship. Reasonable. Yeah, yeah. All right, well, why don't we just get started then? Let's see here. All right, how do I take this off? Okay, I did it. I took it off, didn't I? Yes. All right. Now, how do I get the chat back, Michelle? Did you lose the chat? Yeah. Oh, on the top, there's a tab. It'll Look at the tabs on there. Oh, it says comments. Yeah, I got it. Okay. Yep. There you go. Somebody, okay, there we go. Ruth Ann, come back. They want Ruth Ann back. <laughs> oh, please. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. No, I'm sorry. K Carrie, good point. Laura, is it $5 to ship to Canada? No, $5 in the United States. If you guys want to, um, you know, Buy some from Canada, we can sell them to you, but I can't ship them for five bucks. Sorry about that. I should have said that to begin with. It's in the banner. It's in the banner. <laughs> it's in the banner. Uh, read the banner. Oh. Ruth Ann's already covered it. I feel like I need to be involved. <laughs> she can hear me in there. Like, what? Oh, I feel like this is all going to pot. Maybe it's I should have had it on my channel. <laughs> it's not. I can do that. Just switch to live chat. I'm surprised. Yeah, everybody, make sure you're in live chat. It's going to be. Uh, <laughs> what, what no, no, just I want to hear you do it. No, you do I, it. I'm trying not to step on her toes. <laughs> are you going to let Laura? Are Are you going to let Michelle go first, or are you going to alternate? We're going to alternate okay. because Michelle needs a little time in between her. Gotcha. Yeah. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. All right. So. <laughs> Well, I just had the banner on Carrie. <laughs> Carrie's giving me a hard time. So we need She's to make here. a banner with Michelle's email address. It's, uh, what is, is it Comfy Cozy Living? Yep. With Gmail. Comfy Cozy Living at, oh no, at gmail.com. Perfect. Okay, who's going first? Oh dear, I've already dropped one. I'm supposed to go first, I think. Okay, so for us then, on the aprons, if you are a winner, we need you to send your e your information to us at fatbirdfinds at gmail.com. So you could hear that I wasn't doing that, right? That's why you came in. Right. Fatbirdfinds at gmail.com. We need your name. We need your shipping information. And we need your PayPal email address, right? That's right. So yeah, you we, did it. We've got the information down there at the bottom. So if you are a winner, no matter if you buy one apron or if you buy 21 aprons, $5 shipping all day. 
in the USA. In the USA, definitely. But we'll be in the USA. That's right. <laughs> We'll ship to you wherever you are, but um, USA shipping five dollars. <laughs> Carrie said, "I'm gonna be quiet now. I don't make you nervous. You don't make me nervous, Carrie. You talk all you want." All right, so Laura, take it away. <laughs> okay, so we have a combination. It's really a huge combination. This lady must have collected aprons herself or made them herself, um, but they're all in super good shape. I will tell you if they're not, but I mean, I didn't see any damage hardly on any of them. Some of them are, so do you call them waist aprons, you guys, when they don't have the little bib part? Anyway, that's what I call them. I so call it a half. I don't know. Half? Like a regular, I kind of, actually, to me, that's a regular apron, and the full-size ones are just full-size. <laughs> yeah, okay, I would agree. All right, so remember, they're all $15, and I will show it to you, and then I, I will give you the number. Yeah. And it'll just be the first person to, that puts the number in the chat. First person to claim will have will win the opportunity to purchase. Okay, they're all saying half aprons. Okay. Cocktail apron. Ooh, cocktail apron. So now that um now that MB is here, I think perhaps a demonstration of the apron is necessary. Okay. Oh, she's gonna take you up on it. I can't believe it. <laughs> I'm <laughs> I'm it. I mean, who wouldn't want this apron? I mean, I want it now. <laughs> what? I want it now. I want it now. <laughs> but I love this one. It's cute and purple, and it's got this pretty little vintage floral print for the trim. It's got the little shaped pockets. And, y'all, I'm not going to measure it. You can kind of tell. You know, this is kind of a little shorty one. Ooh, <laughs> you might want to, you know, dress up a little in this little baby. Yes, pancakes for everyone. In this little baby? <laughs> what are you talking about? I don't know. You know, Aprons, oh, come Aprons. on. Aprons, Aprons are totally saucy. Saucy. Aprons can be kind of saucy. Aprons are totally saucy. And can <laughs> I also interject for a moment that I have two aprons in my kitchen. You guys know this because I think you've seen it. At least Laura has. I have one that goes over the doorway to, or the open walkway to my kit, uh, living room that I have um, up with, you know, I have it up. And then I have a sheer one that I bought from Patrick that I have over my um, kitchen sink. Awesome. So I use them as decor. Because I don't have anybody to be saucy for. All right. So for the purple apron, $15 and it's number 27. Number 27. 27. Jamie says we got to put on high heels with that one. Yep. Well, yeah. <laughs> okay, so the first person I have that came through was Gia. Gia Shane. Gia. Gia, Gia. <laughs> thanks, Gia. Thanks, Gia. So, Laura, and thanks, Gia, so much. So, Laura, in case I have to go again, uh -huh. when we switch over to Michelle, I'm going to have you go banners. We're going to take off our yeah. apron banner and put up Comfy Cozy Living and switch. Yeah, All I right. can totally do that. All right. It's, it's Michelle's turn. All right. Okay, so I was going to start with this one, but I'm like, yeah, I better not because that's a lot of money. So, I'll, I'll warm, warm up to it. So, I'm going to start <laughs> in the middle. With this cute little Chinese laundry, gold. It's like a clutch, but mm, mm, kind of not. It's, I don't know what the youngsters, because I mean, come on, let's be real. I'm not carrying this, even though it's super cute. The young ones probably think, oh yeah, you know, there's probably a name for what you grab like with this. I don't know. But it's really soft. It is by Chinese Laundry. It's like got the satin interior, perfectly clean. There's a, a, yeah, isn't it? There's a little hooks for, there's probably like a chain. I would imagine a little chain link or like a gold looking little thin strap. I don't know. I don't know. I, if I had this, I'd be carrying it like this because I think it is fantastic like this. So this is $30. Oh, and if you want a measurement, if you want a measurement, I didn't number anything, but that's okay. 
it's like yeah, eight and a half inches across, maybe. And I was gonna give these numbers randomly. So that is, dude, that's like the perfect little nightclub purse. It is. I'm like, if I let out, I think this would be super cute. It's perfect for. I mean, you don't even have to fit a phone in a purse anymore because nobody puts their phone away, do they? <laughs> He's always got their phone out. But your keys, your lipstick, your, um, I mean, if you are in that way, you might need a couple tampons or something. That all fits in here. Your driver's license, whatever. And uh, off you go. $30 and it's going to be number 69. $30, number 69. And yeah, I cannot see the <laughs> chat. So can you see that if anybody? Oh, I will see it. Yes. Okay. <laughs> I'll watch it for you. Hey, Misty. And you know what? I'm supposed to be writing yours down. It's okay, Michelle. I'm writing them down. It's okay. Oh, you are? Yeah, are you I sure? Mine down. Okay. Yeah, but you can help me watch. Okay, yeah. I'll... I'll... I'll go back to the, I'll go to the chat. So. Oh, Katie at Vintage of Vinyl is putting our emails in there. You're so sweet, Katie. All right. There, I mean, there's a possibility that nobody's going to be interested. Some of these are a little different, and I understand. Okay. I don't see anybody just yet, Michelle. So Yeah, that's fine. I'll switch over and do a couple. Okay. Okay. So now we're back to us boom to the rescue thanks <laughs> okay let's see you guys let's do let's do a christmasy one Ooh, a christmas one everybody likes something christmasy right? yes always so this one is so cute and it is one of the only ones that does have just a little bit of damage because it's but it's because it's so vintagey but look at that. Isn't that sweet? It's got oh, I love tree. that with the trees on the bottom. Isn't that sweet? And the um, trees have the candles in them. And then there's candy canes all over in the pattern. It's got a little pocket. So, yeah, it does have a little bit of wear to it. This one does. And I saw just one or two. I can't find it right now, but there's one or two tiny little holes somewhere in the fabric. I can't really find them right now. They're really small. Like, here's one. Wait a minute. Right there. Okay. Right. But it's so cute and vintage -y. I had to put it in here. You know right. how that happened? Because she was wearing a little red lace bra and that. <laughs> And he came home and he couldn't get that off of her fast enough. So sometimes a couple holes. Oh gosh, might come. Michelle, this is <laughs> not that kind of program. It, well, I don't well, even have a glass of wine. Maybe I need one. <laughs> yeah, this like comes down to my knees. <laughs> I uh, thought you guys get saucy at Fat Bird Fines. That's right. <laughs> so okay, as as all the aprons are, it's fifteen dollars. Okay, and it's number 22. $15, number 22. Mary Beth's fixed this up. The little uh, banner across the bottom is telling you that it's just $5 for shipping, no matter how many you buy. That is right. And I have got Jamie, mid-century wasted on that one. Thanks, Jamie. Thank you, Jamie. We will fix you right up. We will do that. And also, just as a reminder, if you are purchasing from us today, um, that says flipping and sipping, but just, um, you know, <laughs> ignore that. If, if you do win from us today, we do need your YouTube name and your real name, your mailing address, and your PayPal email address. So that is what we need from you. And our email address is fatbirdfinds at gmail.com. All right. And Michelle, I'm going to do one more, okay? Okay. All right. So. I know. You're going again. I took the banner down. Oh, I'm sorry. So you're good. Okay. So also, we have this really cute little yellow checkered one. Checkered? Checked? <laughs> 
Like striped. You can't say check it. <laughs> but it's got two pockets. This one's kind of big. Yeah, and I mean, a lot of them, I think the lady, you know, I think she made some of them in, this, in the 70s and 80s. That was a little more uh, feminine. Yeah, and these are, but they're when they're big like that, they're totally uh, usable. Oh you know? yeah. So I think a lot of these you could totally buy to use in your kitchen. That one would also make a great window balance because it's a light color. That's true. And yes. It will let the light, the sun through. Rick rack, yep. There's Rick rack across the bottom. Oh yeah. Isn't that cute? Mm hmm. It's checkered. <laughs> Don't ever say check it again. Christy says, I'm inspired. I want to make my own apron now. Well, right? then she said stripe it. You guys don't say that, do you? I do. I say stripe it. I have never said that. Checkered and striped. I say stripe it. You said checkered? Checkered. It, or it, checked. It's striped. Just, oh, so I can't it, see it really close enough. For... What do you mean? I think somebody said that the price is different in the banner. Or if it's one of those where she's wearing it and it gets saucy time, then it's not striped, it's stripped. <laughs> uh, I think the price is right in the banner. All aprons are $15 with $5 shipping. Oh, the description says $14 and the banner says $15. What in the description? description of the video. Oh, that's my bad. That's my fault. They're 15, guys. I'm sorry, Amy, and thank you for pointing that out. That was my fault. They are 15. My fault. Accuracy police are in action today. I know. They're going to keep us on our toes. That's right. So, for the yellow check-in. <laughs> that's and like green. naked. Naked check-in. Number four. Yeah. Amy, thank you so much. Yeah, I'm going to see if I can fix that. Number four, and I have Gia again. Nice. J -j -j Gia. <laughs> Thanks, Gia. Gia Schaefer. Thank you. Okay, so I think we're going to take that back to Michelle. Mm -hmm. Well, hello. Hello. So I have this cute little brown woven, I guess you would say, but it's hard, you know, so it's not like gonna, um, it's not gonna get like mushy. It will hold your things in, but you don't want, you gotta be careful. So see, it's like wood ish. It's like that thin kind of wood on the outside. It's a lot of, uh, a look. A lot of these purses are very much a look. Okay. It's got this super cute clasp, two short little, oh, it's so cute. Two short little. Now, this again, I could, I would totally use this in a display. I have a very similar bag like this that opens like this. And I put a, a hanging plant, like a fake hanging plant. Oh, and I love put the, the, you know, the, the part that you would stick in like the foam. Mm -hmm. So I stick it in there. And if you get one that's like thin enough, you could stick it and you can still make it shut. And you set that and then it, it's flowing out. That's what I had on top of my, or have on top of my suitcases. Oh, that's cute. What a great you idea. Could, you could also hang this like on a hook because it's short. Do you see the, the, it's shorter. It's super cute. I love that one. Isn't it cute? It's just got like a little diamond pattern of like a different color of the woven pieces. But it's, it's like, you know, I mean, this is a little so cute. Yeah, I like it. So um, this is going to be $15 and it's number 28. $15 and it's number 28. Oh, that's a great price too, Michelle. Well, you know, some of them I'm going to have really, really good prices and some of them are going to be a little more get what you pay for. <laughs> <laughs> Love that. Cool. So Kat got it. Thank you, Kat. Oh, you saw that faster than I did, Michelle. Just so you know. I'm looking on, um, I'm, I have my um, tablet on. Oh, okay. So that's where I'm looking at. Me. 
You know, it's funny because they were saying that the lag was so bad at my sale, but I looked on there and it was like three seconds. So I don't, I don't know. What? It's weird, right? <laughs> yeah, it is. Cat, that purse is so cute. It's awesome. Okay, let's see. I can do this. You can do it. I know. <laughs> Here I am. See? Here we are. All right. <laughs> okay. Um, Mama Rhonda's here. Hi. Oh, is Rhonda saying hi to us in the chat? Mm-hmm. That's that's cool. Okay. Here we go. Let's see. Let's do um okay. Here's a classic. I've got one that is red with the checked. Trim. Look how cute that is. And it's another I little love that. Because you know I have a red, mostly red kitchen. So I love that. Yeah, that would be really cute in your kitchen, Michelle. Mm hmm And so it's got one pocket and it's got the little lace trim here on the pocket. Let's see if I can get that close. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my God, she is like the wizard. You're right, Christy. <laughs> oh, that is so funny. Can y'all hear Mary Beth in the background coaching me? So okay. I just actually, I don't know how I never had this idea before, but my mind, the wheels always are turning. <laughs> I just realized you could also hang it on the oven rack, like the handle of the oven. Oh, that would be cute. You know, some of them. You could use as a towel almost. You know, some of them have a good, a little thickness. Is she laughing at me? <laughs> Seriously, next time I come to Paducah, I'm going to tie an a apron onto MB's uh, oven. <laughs> right. I don't think she's laughing at you. Um, hey, Greg. Yeah, so I love this one. Super yeah, cute. I like that. It's very cute. All of them are you know they have all of them have very generous ties so they'll make it you know you could there's plenty of room to tie that on and make a big pretty bow with it in the back <laughs> she is she feeling it <laughs> ah, okay so this one red with red check trim is number 13. All the aprons are $15 if you're just joining us and all your shipping for the aprons is $5 in the USA. In the USA. Red checked is number 13. Okay. I had Lois Peavy. Thank you, Lois. Hi, Lois. Lovely Lois. All right. Thank you, Miss Lois. You're going to love that one. So cute. And then let's try one of the full size ones. How about that? Um, I'm going to help you. I'm sorry. Here's one. No, you're fine. You don't have to help. I'm good. Oh, here, this one has got, this one's not homemade. This one is, uh, has got a little tag on it. Let me show that first. Fruit of the Loom and then Cillin's Aprons, which I've never heard Fruit of. Fruit of the Loom? Who knew? I did not know. Right? That's funny. <laughs> yeah. And then, oh, that's awesome. Oh, this is a big one. So this one is the yes. real. Yes. <laughs> I love it. You got to like crawl into like a jumper. Yeah. It's like a jumpsuit. <laughs> I had a small one like that. Who bought that? God, I had like a little one like that. But this one is awesome. I mean, this one's got some oh, yeah. coverage to it right there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's for the big bosom woman. <laughs> I feel pretty good about it. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm getting a vibe. I, you're making me hungry. I think I feel like you're going to make me dinner. <laughs> I'm going to make you some biscuits, Michelle. <laughs> ah! <laughs> With gravy. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, look, it's got the big pockets here. I can't get out of it. Uh-oh. <laughs> 
It's got two big pockets in the front, and then turn it around and show the back. That the back. What is that design? Is that like apples? No, they're roses. Oh, okay, okay. I, I just, you know, mine's. I'm on the phone, and I got it far away, and I don't have my glasses on. No, that's okay. It's got like blue, blue ferns and stuff, and then the pink. Okay, pink. now I see it. I like it. Close up in just a second, but there's the back of it. Now this one has a shorter tie in the back, but it's very generous around the waist. You oh yeah. Know? I'm a big girl, so yeah, this is uh well, this is let's be realistic here. This is not it like in real people terms, this is a real woman's apron. This is a real woman's <laughs> apron. This is our demographic. It, it, for the most part, I mean, I know our women are saying this is something I can wear. Uh-huh. I mean, big and they're not all tiny and you know i'm just saying this is real that's right and it's probably like knee length just about hey laura I'm Melinda. It's for the modest woman <laughs> okay so for the big fruit of the loom full <laughs> size apron <laughs> big fruit of the loom it is 15 dollars, and it's number 19. People are saying their grandmas wore that kind. I know, right? My grandma, you know what I thought of now? My grandma actually called it a house coat. And she had, you know, oh. like some that were like short sleeve. It was kind of like what a duster is, but she wore it. It was like called a house coat. And she would do her, you know, scrubbing the floor and doing the dishes and cooking. Yeah. I had LJ. LJ, thank you so much. LJ, hey. It's a healthy size, that's right. Well, okay, but our email is fatbirdfinds at gmail.com. And I'm sure one of my um, moderators would be nice enough to put our email address into the chat. Katie's doing that. Thanks, and Katie. I'm going gonna... to do one more because. Okay. Yeah. It's a healthy size. Yes, Jamie. I'm a healthy size kind of woman. <laughs> She's healthy. You're healthy. Laura Melinda. That so much better. You're so healthy, MB. You're so I healthy. Go that far, Michelle. <laughs> Vintage thrifted treasures. Laura Melendez is asking about strawberries. Strawberries, and I do have a strawberry one. Hi. Nice. Yay! Up and do that one for Laura. Now, oh, it's so cute. Look how cute that one is. Oh yeah. <laughs> so instead of being, um, some of them, you know, are squared off, but this one's more like a half round shape. And it's got the pretty little eyelet lace all the way around it. I love this one. Mm -hmm. Now, full disclosure, though. Can you show that little spot right there? The eyelet lace has a little spot on it, but I haven't tried to treat it with anything. You guys could probably get that out. But it is there, and I haven't tried it. So Real life, man. Somebody wore that while they were cooking. I know. They're so cute. I see somebody asking about registering before bidding. We don't require that you do that. So, yeah, you're you're good. You don't have to do that here. I mean, if you want to do it while you're thinking about it, just go ahead and send it to us. But you don't have to have done it before. Correct. Same okay. for me. For the most part, I just like to remind people when they're new to me to make sure. So it, it doesn't hurt to send it. Yes. It's not required though. Oh yeah. And so then on top of the eyelet also you can tell you can see here it is is rick rack. So there's red rick rack on the eyelet trim. And that then, so dainty. It's dainty. It's very, you know, sweet little Susie homemaker. I know. And then all those little teeny tiny strawberries. Yeah, okay. that's sweet. For the strawberry lacy half apron, it is number twenty one. Number 21. Oh, I'm going to write that down. What? Okay. Did you see what LJ said? I the was one just. That LJ bought, she wants it gifted to Katie. Well, isn't that sweet? That's so sweet. I All love right. our people. I know, right? I will write that down. Laura, was that number 21? Yes. Okay, I've got Laura Melendez. Oh, and the, and Katie said she's gonna wear it in her Jello videos. Oh, nice. <laughs> That's good. You know what, Katie? That'll be great for when they're really repulsive. Oh, it really will be. That'll <laughs> be so cute. Some of those recipes are pretty disgusting. <laughs> they're they're more than pretty dis. I mean, they are bad. I know, right? Yeah. Ugh. 
You might need to like wear a bunch of, uh, she could wear uh, like three or four, you know, and then every time she gets like sick for one, she could just pull it up, oh. <laughs> take it off, put it to the side. Next one, she got another lovely apron. It'll be like just oh. many colors. It'll be Katie's apron of many styles. But that is such a great idea. <laughs> uh, we got, our people are great. They all have great ideas. It gives okay. me smiles sometimes. It's so cute. I have, I, I'm going to say I have such a variety. So if anybody out there is looking for a certain kind of purse, please throw that in the, in the comments for me. Because I'm going to have some that are just your everyday basic. And I have some that are like, get it, girl. And some that are just so cute. You're going to want to, ah. Uh. So anyway, right now, <laughs> I'm going to pull a cute one out to me. I mean, that's, they're, they're not like, they're all cute. You know what I'm saying, right? right? This is a Lily Bloom purse. I love this purse. Look at this. First of all, it's got a nice, long comfortable strap do you see this great colors popping it's it's um expandable well i gotta expand it all the way because you know then you could do the crossbody thing okay because you know it's safe to be crossbodied with a bag nowadays it's got the cutest color and look like the inside is like that chartreuse and all the little poles say Lily Bloom on them. So then the top, there's two poles, two openings. And then like on the one, you have the little thing for your keys. I love that. Yeah. You think about it when you're like looking for your keys and you're like, oh, now that thing makes sense. <laughs> and then you got your side pockets. Then on the other side, you have not only have you got a little pocket, you got like that for... um like a phone or your glasses. Then you have that, like you have a little, little, little um, Velcro opening. I don't know what you put in there. It's so little. Maybe some of your cards, if you don't want to carry, you know, if you don't want to carry a wallet, you can put just like some of your ID cards or something in there because it's, it's a little small pouch. I'm not really sure. Condoms? I don't know. What now? How about your glasses? With glasses? Yeah, definitely the glasses I think you could put next to that. But in this little pouch, look at that little. It's little. Oh, like, yeah. That's, it's like, what do you put in there? I bet. God, that was, <laughs> oh, God. What'd she say? She's, <laughs> she said condoms. <laughs> Michelle, <laughs> it's 4 o'clock in the afternoon. And afternoon delight is a real thing. I think it was probably for a razor or flip phone. Yeah, it was probably for a flip phone back yeah. then. And then in this pouch, you could put like nowadays phone, right? Yeah. That's a good or your or your keys if you don't if you're not really good with that little other thing inside. And I'm then this, the color. What? I know. And then there's this other pocket too. Maybe put your chapstick there because you know you always wanna Freshen up. But look at these colors. You got your fuchsia. You got your turquoise. You got light pink. You get that chartreuse. This thing is beautiful. And a lot of pockets for all your things. Oh, I just love it so much. It's $30. And look, it's very, like, you know what I mean? Like, if you want to, it doesn't take up a lot of space for storage. Okay. $30. Number 57. $30, number 57. That's and this, so can, this can go shorter, too. But, again, it's great for crossbody. If it fits across me very comfortably, it will fit across you. <laughs> yeah, it's low. I, I love a Lily Bloom. I think they're, they're kind of, like, fashionable and uh, trendy-ish. I don't know if they're still trendy because I really don't care. <laughs> I, don't I like the colors. I love that. These awesome. days, hanging and sanitizer. Yeah, you can put True. it in. You need all that kind of <laughs> Xanax pocket. <laughs> Jamie could have a Xanax pocket. <laughs> hey, Zeno, you looking for a purse? Yeah. 
Zeno is here just in time for purses and aprons. Zeno, you know, are you looking for a purse or an apron? I can see Zeno in an apron. <laughs> hey, I said no judgment. I put that on my thing. I said, hey, no judgment. Gentlemen, welcome. I think that's a great idea. <laughs> I'm all about it. Okay, what do you got next? Oh, I'm just trying to decide. I can't decide what to show next. Well, you better hurry up. Let's see. Do you want me to show another one? Sure. I can do that. Okay. This is more of your everyday purse. Or if you want to get, oh, this would be perfect for Mother's Day. It's a nine and company. There it is. Nine and company. It's kind of a... It's not exactly burgundy. It's not exactly a red. It's more like a brick red. Do you know what I mean? It's not like a cherry red or anything. But it's very, uh, like, it's probably, like, stain resistant, I feel like. It's got all of your compartments in here. Glasses. Um, you know, like a, a little packet of tissue. Your wallet, your hairbrush, your lipstick, whatever, your keys, everything. Everything, you don't have all the outside pockets. This is for somebody that's a little more maybe classic, maybe more traditional. And, um, you know, it's more of a, I mean, you can put it over your shoulder, you know. But, you know, a lot of ladies like to carry a purse like this or like this. This one is uh, $18 and it's number 81. $18, number 81. That's super cute. Very, very nice. Really cute. Yeah, again, if anybody's looking for some kind of special purse, let me know because I have such a variety. All right. All right, move it on. All right. Christy was asking about some, like, vintage kind of botanical ones. This is kind of... I've got a couple, okay? So let's see what you think about these. Oh, that one's really cute. This one's super vintagey. I don't know, you know, how old it is, but that's an old one. And look at those cute little, I think those are what, maybe hydrangeas? I don't really know. Those pots. I don't know much about flowers. But then it's got the little brick, like a brick wall pattern. It's got the little rick rack at the top of the pocket. <laughs> and then it's got the rick rack all the way around. That is so cute. Yeah, and that's kind of a scallop, the scalloped bottom. I like that. Yeah. This one uh, is really, really cute. <laughs> and then it's got two pockets. Two pockets. I and really like that one. I do too. And like I said, I think that's probably, that's one of the older ones that, yeah. that we have. Geranium, somebody said. Probably. That's probably right. Except... Gera geraniums are usually red. I guess they're just, you know, it's got blue leaves too. <laughs> so it's cute. They just got the cute little uh, mid-century color scheme going. Mm -hmm. Okay. And that one is $15, as you can see on the banner below. And yep, it's number 30. Number 30. Number 30, flower pots and bricks. <laughs> Madonna, I loathe hydrangeas. Madonna <laughs> and Zeno. <laughs> <laughs> Who hates hydrangeas? I don't think she said that. I have Sandra K. Sandra K. Okay, thanks, Sandra K. And then what's the other one I was going to show? Oh, you just pulled that one. Yeah. I've got another. I'll show that next round, the full size one that's sort of like Thanks, that. Thanks, Sandra K. But here is another cute little Christmassy kind of one. But you guys are going to like this because it's got pine cones, but then it's got cardinals at the bottom. How cute is that? Does that one have any pockets, Mary Beth? Oh, I love that. I love that Ooh. pattern. I love that black. You know, it's like it gives it like a richness. Because it makes the other colors really pop. It looks like this one was handmade and then pressed and put up and never used, honestly. I don't see, this one doesn't have any pockets though. Okay. All right, so no pockets on that one. But 
I love that one. I think that is so cute. And I love this, those little uh, pine cone pattern all over it. Mm -hmm. so cute. Okay, so what do you have on this one? This is $15 and? And it's number 15. $15, number 15. Good job, Laura. Would be a cute tree skirt, too. What a great idea. Oh, Christy. yeah. Christy's always the one with the great ideas. Christy has great ideas. I have Gia. Oh, thanks, Gia. 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 Gia is all in for some $5 shipping. Oh, yeah. <laughs> See, yes, the, more, yes. the more you buy, the more you save, essentially, because you're saving on all that shipping. That's right. right. Thanks, Gia. Okay, we're going to take it back to Michelle. Hello. Um, Hello. When I used to do uh, occasional sales in, here in town, um, I occasionally was also on uh, a local television show. And one time um, I had, the my background was, I had strung, it looked like a clothesline full of aprons all the way across. Cute. So if people like have a room to be able to, like if people love, like collect aprons and it looks, they look so cute. You actually use real clothes pins. You just bring it close up to the ceiling and you know, you have clearance. Well, it's, wouldn't that be adorable? Yeah. I mean, you know, for women, maybe not if you have a, a, a healthy masculine presence in the house, but <laughs> you know what I'm saying, right? <laughs> so anyway, my next purse, I believe it's probably not as vintage as I wish it was. It's by Mag Magid, M-A-G-I-D. I didn't have time to look that up. So it's probably not really um, vintage, but it certainly has that vibe. It's made in China, but it's definitely got that cool vibe. Um, most of these beads, it's all wooden beads. And I think there's only a couple that maybe have like a little, little wear like right here. By my oh gosh, by this finger. Can you even see that right there? Oh yeah, you can see that. Just a teeny bit of wear. It's a, it it has uh the inside the and the zipper's great. The inside has a nice uh lining and then it has that little inside pocket. It's actually a decent size. You know, you see my hand, right? So mm -hmm. and then a nice and it's comfortable. Like it's not this beads. They don't. It's not uncomfortable. It's a nice little bag. That's going to be fifteen dollars, and it's number two. Fifteen dollars, number two. That's cute, Michelle. It's definitely got that seventies. Uh, yeah, but it's also kind of, like, kind of springy, summery to me. Even mm -hmm. fall, really. Hmm. Imagine if you got the kittens. Oh, okay. Carrie, surely they're not sending you um, real kittens, right? <laughs> Polly, you got it. That's RP is Polly. I got you, Polly. Hi, Polly. Polly is in P-O-L-L-Y? Like Polly want a cracker. Awesome. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, Polly. Thank you. And you guys, it, don't feel bad about moving quickly. I know a lot of people are just here for the aprons more than, you know, because it was because we, you know, didn't get to pump it out there very much. So I'm totally okay with that. Okay. All right. Okay. So I've got another cute one here. Another vintage -y one. Or more vintage, I should say. Oh, this one goes around your neck. Look how cute that is. Look at the pattern. Yeah. This one is, is a little smaller in size than the rest of them, but super, super cute. It's got that, uh, it's got like watering cans and the big gardening hats. Uh, yeah, this is not for big girls like some of the others. Zeno, I see you. She, he said, Laura, are you playing hooky? I, I have to work on Saturday, so when that happens, I get a half day. So this is my half day. So I worked, I was putting it in there. <laughs> oh, you're already putting it in there? So I worked, I got off at 2.30. Uh, 
And Zeno also wanted to know how, where the aprons came from. They came, we got one big auction lot. It was a big box and it was listed as scarves because there were two or three scarves on the top. But it was really a whole box of aprons and we were so excited. <laughs> yeah, this would be a really good apron for a kid. You might, oh, it would be. you might have to take up the net a little bit, but yeah, definitely. Yeah, and it's also a good display apron because Michelle was throwing out all those cute display ideas and the sm the smaller ones are cute for that. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it is $15 and it's number 28. Number 28. Katie Garnett. Hello, Katie Garnett. Hey, Katie. Hey, Katie. <laughs> All right, I see Marty Her Marty Her Marty. <laughs> Thanks, Marty. Thanks, Marty. I'll write it. Okay. All right, and then let's do. How about? How about sunflowers? Sunflowers. I think sunflowers are pretty. And you know, sunflowers can be summery, and they can they can look. Kind of like autumn as well. But yeah, this is a good Ooh, one. That is colorful. That's sweet. Isn't that pretty? For somebody who has like a yellow kitchen, that would be really perfect. Oh, yeah. This is another one that would fit, you know, a true woman. <laughs> Isn't that what somebody <laughs> Look at the pocket. Hi, Joy. There's the pocket, and it's got these cute little buttons on it. Again, this one looks like somebody handmade it, pressed it, and put it up and never used it. it I don't think it's ever been used. <laughs> hey, look. So if you can show that uh, the, this little lace trim, it's really cute because it's got pineapples in the lace down there. Oh, isn't that cute? So I think that's sweet. Can you guys see that? Right? And this, oh, yeah. This one's definitely one that you could use. Oh, yeah. Totally. All right, but I think those are beautiful. Those that sunflower pattern is so pretty, and it's fifteen dollars, like all the rest of them. And it's number eight. Number eight. And I'll do one more. How about that? Mm hmm. All right. Let's see here. I have Jane Smith. Jane Smith was number eight. Thanks, Jane. Um, you got it. You got it. And if you're just now joining us, um, Laura and I are selling aprons. The information is down there across the bottom. All of our aprons are $15, and we're only charging $5 shipping. So if you buy one, if you buy 21, <laughs> $5 shipping within the uh, United States. We will ship to anybody, but we can't do $5 just uh, abroad. So. That's what we're doing. Um, our information is fatbirdfinds at gmail.com. And then Michelle is selling purses. So we're going to do one more apron and then take it over to Michelle. I think we disappointed Zeno with that one. He did not like. He did not like the sunflower apron. I wish I had another one, Zeno. I would send it to you. We just send that right to you. Maybe he needs to get in the market for a purse. No, yeah. Jane. No, Jane. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, so here's another full size one. Full size, real size is. Oh, this one has rickrack all the way around, yeah, right? Got the cute little paisley pattern to it. Look at all that rickrack. It's on um, both sides. That one goes over your head. <laughs> I like to be the model. <laughs> it makes me feel like I'm going to make something. Really and we awesome. are liking it. I'm here for it. <laughs> Hi, Booed. So yeah, this one, in the this one falls like right at my knees. Just so you know, I can't tiptoe up enough, but. Yeah, and it's, it's, it's pretty vintagey looking, don't you think? Again, somebody made this, handmade it, and pressed it, and put it up, and never used it. I don't think this one's ever been used either. I don't think really any of them have been. A few of them have. Let me show that Rick Rack better. <laughs> Carrie said she thought those were hams. Hams. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that's funny. <laughs> okay. All right. So the Paisley with the Rick Rack trim, full size. 
is number 20. Number 20. Christy wants to know if you think that's a racket. It kind yeah. of is. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> <a racket. Okay. sighs> All right, Sandra K, number 20. Sandra Thank you K, so much. you got it. All right. All right, so we're going to switch back over to Michelle. All right. Hello. All right, so I have, I'm going to go with um, this one to start off with. I have a couple of cat purses, but if my cat people aren't here, I don't know. This reminds me of that brand Baby Fat, P-H-A-T, like super trendy, I guess. I don't know. But it's um, probably not. <laughs> it is like a rhinestone kitty cat. Like a rhinestone kitty cat. <laughs> <laughs> it's polka dot on the inside of the, of, it's super cute with that. Oh, cute. Look at this. It's got like that satiny inside. Nice with the polka dot. It's so cute. It's always nice when there's an extra little detail inside. It's got your little pockets. It's got your zipper, you know, the side zipper also. And then the back has a zipper as well. I think this is leather. I don't know what the brand is, though. I don't know. It's weird how some of these don't have any brand, any branding on them, but um, it's, I'm sorry. It's going to be $15 and it's going to be number 51, $15, number 51. Man, that's super cute, Michelle. Thank you. I can do another one if you guys want me to. Yeah, sure. And if anybody buys it, we'll see. But um, then I got uh, I'm pushing them all by my side. <laughs> then I have this little Croft and Barrow. It's brand new with the tags. Uh, well, let's say I'm pretty sure it's brand new. The um little. Mirror still has its little film on it, and it's attached with that plastic. This little thingy is still in here. And then you got, oh, it's starting to rain. Uh, then you got a, a little coin purse that's still attached. Also, it's very multi-functional. Uh, it's got like a little uh, coin purse opening. It's got very many like little slots opening here. And then another little side pocket and it's got your this snaps off the little key thing snaps off and there's this also this must have just like came off of there but that's also for like your cards it's very very uh organized and again a couple more pockets and then here's the Piece de resistance. <laughs> if you want to take off the strap, you can put it on your belt loop. Oh, oh you need to drop it. Isn't that cute? Yes. It's like a it's like a fanny pack, but not. It's like oh that's I mean, isn't that cute? Yes, that is so cute. Yeah, it's fifteen dollars and it's number eight. I feel like that, that we need that shopping. You know, I thought I had a great idea at the flea market to fit my backpack, but then you have to take the backpack off to get to your wallet and your money. That's that's, that's why I'm always I wear a crossbody, like, and I don't hardly put anything in it because that can really weigh you down too. A crossbody. This would be even better because it's just on your waist. But I've already used to having a lot, you know, in the middle. Okay, so Michelle, back to your number 51 purse. I had Melinda Hess. Okay, thank you. For a uh, number 51 purse. And then on your number, was that last purse you did number eight? Yep. Okay, I've got Elaine Wallace. All right, Elaine, thank you. And please make sure to send me your information at um, comfycozyliving at gmail.com. And Melinda, I will be combining 
and anybody else, because Melinda bought at my last at my sale today. If you bought at today's sale, it I'll be combining all this. Yeah. And then LJ, I've seen you put a couple random numbers into the into the chat. I'm not really sure what your she's lagging a little bit. Oh, let's let's just do a brief um refresh. I think some of you might be lagging. So why don't you go out of the video and come back? Um, that way you'll be up to date with us just in case you are lagging. And make sure that you're in um, live chat instead of talk chat. That will help you as well. So I'm going to give you guys a few minutes to do that. Yeah. Some for decoration behind me. We'll have to get those down here in a second. Okay. Else? Let's see. I've got, I've got pumpkin. What? Uh, I've got some, a couple of autumn friends, like with pumpkins and gourds and autumn leaves. Oh, this is going to be good. I'm interested in those. Or I've still got some, a couple of Christmas ones. Someone said you got cats. Let's see. Well, I know people love the Christmas ones. Yeah. Angie Christie says yes. Okay. All right. So we'll do a few of those. Here, you pick, why don't you pick one of your, like, and uh, also, I have a classic Dooney and Burke. If anybody in the comments could tell me if you're even interested. Otherwise, I will not bother. Okay. Okay. Angie Christie says fall is my favorite. Do you have one that's kind of like yes, fall? I do. In fact, this one's really pretty. Okay. Okay. This is super cute fall one. Oh, look at that. Here, let me, I forgot to switch our stuff. Hold on. And <laughs> there, and there. All right. Oh, yeah. Look how cute that is. Look how pretty that shows. So the background at the top is just like a bunch of leaves and fall leaves and greenery. And then the bottom trim is big, pretty pumpkins and gourds. This is another one that's been handmade, pressed, and, and never used. It's, it feels brand new. <laughs> so yeah, lots of lots of uh, excess, you know, room to tie in and that. I, yeah, and I think I mean, if you were ever gonna wear an apron, it would be Thanksgiving time, right? Where you're like all day in there, and then you want to look good mm -hmm. at Thanksgiving dinner, so you want to do your apron, and then. And this one's got the two big pockets in the front, so. The whole palm of my hand fits down in these pockets. <laughs> yeah, I think that one would be great for that. Okay, so this one is fifteen dollars, mm -hmm. and and it's number sixteen. Fifteen dollars, sixteen. Lovely, lovely. You're lovely, Michelle. Aw. <laughs> <laughs> and we have Gia Schaefer. Gia coming in strong. We'll get your Gia. I can't stop, you guys. It's like a, a reflex thing. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. And then I will go ahead and do, let's go she ahead and do I am done. <laughs> yeah. She famous last words, Gia. Famous yeah. last <laughs> words. <laughs> one more fall, I think. Yeah. There's one more fall one, so we might as well go ahead and do that one. Oh, wait a minute. I think the strings are in the pockets. Yeah. yeah. That one's super fall. Hey, Gabby Licious. It's got pumpkins all over it. And so this one's really cute because it's got the really wide eyelet lace at the bottom. Yeah. Check out the lace at the bottom. And it's got a big pocket. <laughs> Gia, save me from myself. <laughs> <laughs> she, she's gonna see another cute one and then she's gonna say but that shipping deal I have to <laughs> this one's got lots of room in the back to tie as well and this one has the two big pockets in the front too with the little ribbons tied oh it's got two pockets yeah that's nice okay so you've got pumpkins pumpkins and pockets and lace oh my <laughs> oh my <laughs> and it's number seven number seven Hey. Very nice. Okay, I have Auntie Cr 
Christy. Yay. Thanks, Christy. All right, and I'm going to give that back to Michelle. Okay. So I have, I'm going to pull out the, the big guns now. Oh, All right. man. Now, this is not one of the vintage purses. This is just one of the more, let's say, now trendy, cool girl purses. Okay. Okay. Because I got, I got vintage and I got, oh, uh, yeah, I got vintage. But this is so good. Uh, you guys ready? It's called, it's by Chala. Oh. Chala. Are you watching this? Look at this kitty cat. Look at that. Isn't it oh. awesome? And then look at that button. Oh, these details are amazing. Look at that. A cat person. Look at, that. Have that. See this? Look at the fish. Where is it? <laughs> Isn't that the coolest? It says chala. And then there's a little flower. And it says chala, chala, chala. I don't know anything about this chala. But you get a free keychain. <laughs> so look at the little fish. Yeah, isn't that cute? Okay, so then, and that that comes off, so that's like a keychain. And then this is like, um, oh my god, it's like a belt. What's that? It's cloth. Do you know what I'm? What's the word I'm looking for? Oh, I don't know. I'm sorry. You know, like a strap. <laughs> I don't, I can't think of the, but it's, it's so cute. Cause it's like got that stitching on it. Mm -hmm. Cause you would think that it would be like leather or something, but and then it's oh, like, like a seatbelt strap. Yes. But it, it's very, it's cloth. It's so neat. And then it's this, it, this is so soft. Uh, mm. And look at the inside. O M G. How cute is that? So cute. It is right. And then you got your side pocket of course your little zip but and then this one has you know your couple little like put your glasses over here and and you know but then this one's like one of those just that big old put it in there you know see how big it is but then here's another look at this i don't you just love a cool detail like that look at that did you see that it's a side pocket i like that it's like a secret like like look it's like a secret that's adorable. Okay, Isn't so like, it? yes. I we, love, I love that kind of detail. First of all, I'm not even a cat person, but that thing is so cute. I would carry this purse. Now, the little, I don't know if that's meant, I guess it's meant to be like a pocket right here. Okay. So I'm saving that for last. Again, the details. You got a little pocket here. You could like stick your little... Like if you got like your grocery list, stick it right in there. You get to the grocery store, you pull it right out. There it is. Okay. Christy Williams said that it'd be cute to use as a knitting bag. It's, it's, I don't know. It's so good. And it's not, I don't know, because it's very um, mushy, you know, it's not like sturdy, but look, at, can we just take a look at these cat, the cat's eyes <laughs> and nose? <laughs> <laughs> Ah, oh, so I love cute. it. It's just so cool. And let's get a I'll, I'll get a like a dimension. The bag itself is Carrie wants to know if you can adjust the handle or the straps. No, I don't think so. the the bag itself is like 16 inches, and then the straps no are not adjustable. And so basically from top. Eh, about 10 inches there. I mean, I can get it over, you know, my shoulder, you know, if it's not winter and I'm not wearing a jacket, you know what I mean? I can get it in there, but, and I'm a big girl. So, you know, skinny girls can easily throw it over there, but I would just carry it like that. I mean, you want everybody to see that. You don't want to color, cover that up. <laughs> oh, it's so good. Anyway, this is going to be $50. And it's number five. And I realize this might not be for everybody, but it's a statement purse. This is what this is. It's so cute. It is. I love I, this is right here. The selling point for me. 
I'm such a sucker for stuff like this. And then you put your keys on here. Me too. All the expensive purses have those little charm. You're, I, I got your purses coming. I got your box right there. I just got to, I think I need a bigger box. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna have, I think I need a bigger box. That's never good, right? <laughs> that's I, adorable, Michelle. Michelle, that's so cute. Thank you. They're asking about the style of Dooney. I don't know what it's called. I'll give you a peek, okay? It's classic. Yeah, just show a sneak peek of it so they can decide whether they're. It's the classic. That's cute. Mm -hmm. right. You know, I have one. Let me know, Michelle, if you um, if you get a whole lot of interest in in the Dooney's thing. I've got one that used to be my daughter's. Mm -hmm. and, um, the older one when she was young, it was like her first nice purse, and it's a vintage Dooney, and it's like a bucket purse. You remember how they? Made oh it? yes. Well, I like to see it on um, QVC or whatever. I like the lady that works for Dooney. I love her voice. <laughs> So I used to love watching it. I knew I was never buying a purse, but I always loved the presentation. Yeah, they have, they've got great stuff. Mm -hmm. And also, like, this helped me because, like, a nine and company purse and some of these other trendier ones, I wouldn't normally sell, like, on a Tuesday because we I do vintage. Right. So some of these I can sell on Tuesdays in a vintage sale, but, you know, some of these are just cute and, you know. You guys better be thinking about that cat purse. That was awesome. <laughs> okay, yeah, it's really good. All right, guys, let's see what Laura has next. What you got? Just sit there and hold up that cat purse over there to the side, Michelle, <laughs> while we're selling up her ear. Yeah, that is so cute. We saw somebody ask about bibbed um, aprons uh -oh. in the chat. So, yeah, we'll do here's that one next. Okay, so here's one. I have to put it on. <laughs> of course you do. Oh no, my glasses. Uh oh. Whoa. Uh -oh. Okay. So, yeah. Here you go. So it's a really cute blue and red plaid, mm -hmm. and it is covering up everything. Oh yeah. Right this there. is some full coverage right here. <laughs> and yeah, really long. Oh my story. god! I want to call you grandma. Are you gonna make pierogi now? Maybe <laughs> if you're lucky. So look at these big old pockets in the front. You could put your snacks in here. I mean, you could just wear this. <laughs> you could only have this on. <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, this wow. Is, this is a long one. This one goes down past my knees. <laughs> so yeah. It's a little thin, Mary Beth, but you know, a little bit. <laughs> Mary Beth, I will pay you $20 if you will wear that on flipping and Sipping tomorrow night. Okay. Only, I mean, only. Like, yeah. No way. <laughs> you can wear um undergarments. You can up your price, and we'll talk. I can't afford that. I'm cheap. <laughs> so here's the here's the close up of the pattern and the pocket. Oh, that's I mean, I wanted to say fifty, but also is it's kind of um your colors. <laughs> A little bit. Yeah, yeah, it really is. Okay, so fifteen dollars. That is number three. $15, number three. Christy says that is a Ruth Ann dress. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, also, also, if I really had to up the ante, I'm pretty sure I could have that money done by the end of this show. <laughs> <laughs> you might get some donations for that one. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> I've got Sandra K. Thanks, Sandra. Okay, and we'll do uh, another bib one. Mary Beth, how's that? Okay. This one also is a bib style. Can I put that one too? Yeah, sure. And it is your classic red and white check. Oh, yeah. That's a good one. This is a great one. That's a barbecue one. You need that for the grill. Barbecue apron. <laughs> Carrie wants to know if we're doing a craft. Wouldn't you like to know? Yeah, <laughs> Carrie, Carrie, you come over and we'll do whatever you want. <laughs> I think we should deco camouflage something. That sounds good. Tomorrow night. So this one comes like just, just above my knees. So this one's just classic. Here. 
apron. I love that one. This one would actually be super cute as a gift because anybody would like that. You could like get a little uh, set of grill tools or something and then put that apron with it and it'd be so cute or cute hostess gift or something. I love that one. And this one just has one pocket in the front. One pocket. Gotcha. One pocket. Okay. So like the rest of them, it's $15. Number 24. $15, number 24. Somebody said that would be great for a costume, too. Oh, yeah. yeah, that'd be really cute. Because it's just your classic one that everybody thinks about. If you said draw an apron oh, on yeah. Pixar, you would probably draw that. That would be it. <laughs> okay, I have Gabrielle. Gabrielle, thanks. Thanks, Gabrielle. Gabby-licious. Gabby-licious. <laughs> Is that what you said, Michelle? That's what I call her, yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. I'm gonna take if that was my name, that's what I would make everybody call me. <laughs> no doubt. All right, Michelle, you're up. All right. Um, I don't even have a price ready, but I'm good. Um, I have this uh brand new Franco Sarto. It's uh, Italian, apparently. It's a wallet. It's like one of those kind of like, I guess, clutch kind of everything can easily go in here. You can even probably fit a phone in here. You know, set it right in there. You can fit all your cards, all your IDs. It's got a nice print on it. You got your coin zip. You got all, all the compartments for your bills. You got some places for receipts. It is silver because you are styling. It has tags on it, brand new, $36. It's called the Gina in light pewter. And the tags is 36. You know what I say? I say 18. No, I say 15. $15. And it's number 33. That's super cute, Michelle. Did you say the tag said 30 something dollars? 36. Awesome. Yeah. Oh, what's that? That's cute, too. <laughs> Oh, I got plenty. <laughs> you want me to do another one? You really do have a lot, don't you? <laughs> yeah. Mary Beth, that one that she's got now reminds me of that one that you that you bought with your little anime. This anime. is another Lily Bloom. Hokey dokey. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's cute. Mm -hmm. So yeah, this one. The colors are just a little different, a little like more bold. And also while they are bold, they're also, it still has that gray background. So it's like a little more toned down even than that one that was like pink and you know, the fuchsia and chartreuse and all that. But again, you got the awesome pocket there. You got the awesome pocket there. And then this one is a little different. It has the two, you know, two, this one just has the side. And it just has so two sides, okay? It's a perfect crossbody again here. That pattern just makes me happy. I just love that. Mm-hmm. It's another crossbody bag with, and it's adjustable. Okay, goes over me. Super cute. And again, it, this is just like so easy to wipe clean and everything. So this one's going to be $23 and it's going to be number, what? Huh? Oh, $23 and it's number 23. You stopped. I was on the edge of my seat. I was like, what? Oh, I thought you were saying something. I'm sorry. <laughs> number 23. That's what you said, right? Yes. yes. All right, Miss Jamie wants that one, Michelle. Oh, get it, girl, get it. I love that one. Yay. My other half. 
All right. If you're just joining us and you have no idea what's happening, Laura and I are selling aprons and Michelle is selling purses. So on our aprons, we're selling them all for $15. And the shipping on, on everything that you buy today from us is going to be $5. That's right. So if you buy one apron or if you buy 21 aprons, the shipping mm -hmm. on our end is going to be $5. Yeah. And it's and then the shipping's calculated for Michelle's. Also, if you don't know what to do after you win from us, we need uh, you to send us an email, fatbirdfinds at gmail.com. We need your YouTube name and your real name along with your mailing address and your PayPal email address. And you can send that to fatbirdfinds at gmail.com. All yeah. right. All right. So you Christmas lovers, I've got several Christmas ones right in a row here to do. So here we go with that one. The first one is this really cute little snowman. So it's got an all over snowman pattern. Okay. Two pockets. I always like the two pockets. It's snowmen and snowflakes. <laughs> Isn't that cute? And I like the green background with the snowman. Oh, that's cute. And it and I love that little those little stripes that makes it really look like it's snowing. <laughs> oh. And then it's got that big piece of lace across the bottom to dress it up a little. It's got these buttons on the pocket. Are you modeling that one? Oh as well? yeah, I've got to do it. I've got to yeah. model. And yeah, it's give got the people thing. give the people what they want. Oh yeah, <laughs> I think it really goes with my Alice in Chains. Yeah, shirt. It's, it matches your shirt. It really does, especially in this frame here. It's a perfect <laughs> balance. It really is. It's got these two big pockets in the front. <laughs> it's like leather and lace. You ain't kidding. <laughs> All right. Oh okay. And so uh, snowman and lace, and it's number one. Number one, fifteen dollars. Katie says she loves it when you model. Oh, she Katie. says we. We love it when you model. Thanks, Katie. <laughs> I wouldn't do this for just anybody. <laughs> Lois, Katie. Thanks, Lois. Thank you, Lois. Okay, we've got another one. We'll do a Christmas one, but the bib style, because we had people ask about the bib style earlier. We had these little things all pressed and folded and paper clipped. So they would fold correctly in a square. Well, how adorable is that? I know, right? So I don't believe you're so perfectly organized. No, not me. Whoever oh. made these and pressed them did this. Oh. Yes. So look how cute this one is. Oh, this one's really good. I like the trimmings on this one. I love, oh, I love everything about that. So it's yeah. the poinsettias and then... The little pocket looks like a little elf pocket, right? <laughs> With the buttons. I love that. Did you say elf pocket? Well, like if an elf had a little pocket in his suit, that's what I would imagine it would look like. You could fit an elf in there. I was just going to say that. <laughs> I feel like there should be a little, um, like a felt, like a uh, um, poinsettia on there. So look at this little rickrack, these two lines of rickrack that go across that's there. Super now that one's just that one is perfectly Chris Christmas. Like if you were gonna have like a cookie exchange or something, you wouldn't even have to be cooking for that to be so cute to wear, right? Oh, yeah. I mean that would just like be the perfect little vintagey cuteness <laughs> to wear to your little Christmas party. Cuteness. Yes. Love okay. it. Okay. All right. So fifteen dollars. Poinsettia bib apron is number twenty six. Number twenty six. Love it. Yep. So cute. 26. And then I'm hungry. <laughs> Did talking about cookies make you hungry? Yeah, a little bit. All this cooking, right? <laughs> I'm just I'm still taking a little bite. Look, I got a little bit left. <laughs> oh man, I am hungry too. I had Sonia M. Thanks, Sonia. Thank you, Sonia. We appreciate it. All right. We're staying with the Christmas theme for a second here. And let's see. <laughs> We've got ones for, with gingerbread on them. What was this? What did this go with? Oh, wait. That's the one we just sold, right? No? Oh, sorry. Here. That one goes over here. 
I wrote, oh. I wrote it on the wrong thing. Gotcha. I think you probably took my card while I was. Oh yeah, blame it on me. That's fine. So this is cute. They have used. Oh, here's the paper clips again. They've used the little gingerbread fabric. Isn't that cute? Gingerbread fabric. Mm -hmm. Again, the same thing. It would be so cute for. If you had a little cookie exchange party where you, you know, go and bake cookies. And, and that's got the lace around it. And then there's the lace at the bottom. I used to decorate my kitchen in all gingerbread for Christmas. Oh, yeah? Yeah. That okay. would have been cute then. This one just has the one pocket with the lace around it on the front, on the one side. Lots of room to tie. That's cute. That's kind of a, that's really a cute vintagey kind of 80s kind of fabric. Those yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right. So it is number 23. Number 23. Miss Lois Peavy. Lois yeah. Peavy. You got it, sister. And then, so while we're on the subject, this one kind of goes with it. It looks like they use the same kind of fabric. But the, but the gingerbread guys are all over, and it's trimmed in the solid green and red, which is cute, too. Oh, yeah, very similar. So there's the, the fabric. up. So it's kind of, you know, the little country it's kind of like the little country gingerbread hearts kind of theme mm -hmm. like that was popular in the 80s yeah and this one has a green and a red pocket with the lace oh so yeah that was super cute too i don't know which one is my favorite of those two you could be a hand model mary beth <laughs> what does that mean well you do a nice hand job with the pockets excuse me <laughs> 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 oh dear this is really taking a turn <laughs> All right, this cute little gingerbread apron is number 17 number 17 adorable <laughs> oh everybody kind of thought that was hilarious I bet they did <laughs> they're my people <laughs> alright is that your last one for, for this round, yes. All right, we're gonna take it back to uh, Michelle. Huh? I have a super cute Tommy Hilfiger with this like Madras, Madras, Mad how do you pronounce that? I never really was sure. Madras, Madras? Madras? Madras print. It, it's very like, uh, a very nice day at the country club, but you know, but like casual, right? And then it's like got the cute little, I love that kind of detail, like that, just different. I like it. It's got like a rope and then a knob. I love it. I love a nubbin or a nobbin, whatever. It's turquoise. And cleanable. Love that. This is Tommy Hilfiger. I mean, am I that old that is that not cool anymore? I don't know. But then it's got the pockets on the inside for like your glasses and your whatever. And then also your inside zipper pocket for, you know, the things you want zippered up and stuff. And it's just, the, you know, it's, it's, you could carry it like that, but I think it's meant because it's got like a wider and also look how cute, look how cute that is. And then it's got the hill figure thing on there. See where it says Tommy hill figure on the loop around the, like the grommet thing. And then this, because it's wider, it just sits perfectly on your shoulder. But then if this is under you safe, safety. Ladies, important, but also it's so cute, right? Like I love the 
this like this leather is like kind of split. It's not like a just a chunk of leather or something. And it's just cute. This le like canvas or good God Almighty, what is that belt stuff called? I gotta figure. That's like gonna be my thing. I gotta figure out what that's called. So anyhow, I think it's really cute. Oh my God, it goes all the way around on the bottom. Isn't that the most adorable thing? Look, it's cute. This is super cute. I should up the price, but I'm not. $20, number 44. $20, number 44. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Yeah, remember Michelle, they used to make belts out of that. Yeah, you know, that's what I was saying before, but what is that called? When we were in high school and the, and the buckles, you know, you could, yeah. You go loop it and then you got to pull it the other way. Yes. Or that the other kind that had the like the the thing and you locked it in. Yeah. I had a pink one and a purple one. Oh. <laughs> yeah, this is super cute. Yeah, that is it's super preppy. It's so cute. It is. It is so good. <laughs> yeah. uh. Alright. Should I do another one or no? Yeah, you can do one more. I have like a, a, a wallet. It's a Vera Bradley. Um, I only picked it up because it was a good price and I because I thought, you know, I, I knew I was going to be doing the sale. Um, not this sale, but you know what I mean. And um, so it's cute. It's got all the compartments you need for one of these just like, you know, like and it's got the every. I know a lot of people love their, their Vera Bradley. So this one. OK, so the one thing I did notice this one totally clips easy. This one you just have to use your finger to and it's totally secure but um it's got that really pretty like is that a dahlia 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 i think i like the colors i like the style i'm not crazy about a lot of the vera bradley patterns it's just not my thing um there is one with cute little pink elephants i like but it's just just not my bag <laughs> so um this is going to be 12 dollars, and it's number 21 $12, number 21. And also, just so I can add in, if anybody has seen something that they like and that I haven't sold, in, like, email me. <laughs> and we can talk. All right, Michelle, it looks like we have Lois Peavy for your Thank you, Lois. Uh, Vera Bradley. That was super cute. I love that one. Yeah, it's cute. I like that um, fabric or whatever it's called, the pattern. Okay, so I'm just going to interject one more time in case you're just joining us that Laura and I are selling aprons for $15 a piece. Michelle is selling purses. Um, on our end, uh, if you're interested in any of our aprons, we are offering $5 shipping on those. So whether you buy one or whether you buy 21, $5 shipping. Because they're easy to ship. We'll just stick them in a bag and get them out to you. That's right. And our email address is fatbirdfinds at gmail.com. So if you're a winner, um, we're going to need your YouTube name along with your real name, your mailing address, and your PayPal email address. And again, those go to fatbirdfinds at gmail.com. And Katie at Vintage and Vinyl is being sweet enough to put... Uh, those email addresses into the chat periodically. So thank you, Katie. <laughs> Thanks, Katie. Okay, here's another cute little red and white checkered one. Don't say yeah. cute. <laughs> it's so cute. So these checks are smaller than the, the previous one. And on these pockets, is it just one pocket or two? There's just one. I think one on this one. So on the pocket is this really pretty lace. Again, I really think this is one that was made, pressed, and put up. I don't think it was ever used in its life. Look at that pretty lace. Ooh, I like that. That that lace is great. And it's got the it red top and the bottom of the trim. Yeah. So real pretty. Got the pocket real here. Real nice big pocket. Comes down to about my knee. And you can make a big pretty bow with these. Hold that up. See how long the 
Oh yeah, the straps are super long on, on most of most all of these. Okay. So for the red and white checkered one, it is number 14. Number 14. Laura, if you say checkered one more time, we might have to fight. <laughs> I'm so I, know, I keep thinking she said naked. I'm so sorry that we don't have stripes, so I can say striped. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I've got Katie, vintage and vinyl. Look, look at look at little Dixie back right here behind us. <laughs> Dixie Cup! She's gonna lick her butt any minute. Oh no, oh, Dixie Cup! <laughs> Thanks, Katie. All right, and then let's see. So here's another little Christmassy one. Right here. That's super cute. Look at that one. So, oh yeah, that's cute too. That little, it's that pretty Christmas red color, but it's got a really pretty little vintage holly mistletoe kind of trim. Here, let me take that comment down. And that fabric really looks vintage to me. I think so. Um, it's all uh, sewn with like a top stitch, like a zigzag top stitch, which is really pretty all down the ties. The ties are green. So these pockets um, have the lace at the top and then the stitch down and then the, the buttons are actually at the bottom, which is a really cute touch. And then the straps are green. Okay. And then grab that. Um, Wait, what? I have to model it. Was that Nikki? Yes, that was Nikki. Oh, she, I didn't see it. She home from work. Really? She didn't say hi to me? Whatever. <laughs> I think she was trying not to interrupt. What do you need? Why don't you just... You're keep what pointing you at something. What is well, it? Well, why don't you just grab that gingerbread one that didn't sell and we'll throw that one in with this one. Okay. For the $15. There you go. Yeah, you're going to get a really cute little gingerbread guy with that one. Okay. okay. So this so, is a two for 15 and it's number six. Sorry, I have a scribble on there. I accidentally wrote somebody's name on the wrong card. Number six, Auntie Christy. Auntie Christy. Okay, Auntie Christy. You got it, Auntie Christy. I'll put those together. Okay. And we'll go one more time? Sure. All right. I think we're going to end with this one back here. This one's the cutest one. So oh, we'll, yeah. We'll do that one when we decide that we're done. Here's a, I didn't get those on my list, just so you know, if you want to fill those sure, in. Sure, I got it. Okay. So here's one with the bib. Okay. And this one is yellow with this pretty little gray pattern. I think Mary Beth had that one in the background of the thumbnail pretty sure right I don't know and this one's big it's got a great big pocket right here and I know it's kind of hard to tell because that pattern on screen is kind of overwhelming but see you can see here the I have pocket to, right there I have to model it there's no trim or anything on this one it's all out of the same pattern oh this is a good one <laughs> Oh, yeah. Wait, we have to take that comment. Yeah. You better keep your shirt on with this one, Mary Beth. Yeah. Like, uh, you have to, uh, you you have to I think you'll have to take up the next strap on this one. Uh, but these these are good. Uh, just one pocket, right? Yep. This is a big pocket, though. This is, like, enough for two hands. <laughs> oh. You can do all sorts of, put all sorts of stuff in there. <laughs> Did you show the fabric? Oh, please say the number. We can't see it. Okay. I, I, I can just see somebody coming around, wrapping their arms around you, and putting both of their hands in that pocket. <laughs> Here's the fabric close up. Again, I don't think this one has ever been used in its life. Okay. So this one's $15. Yeah. $15. And it's number 29. Number 29. 29. Yeah, that one's great. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's a big one. All right, Miss Lois Peavy. Lois Peavy, you got it. All right, I'm going to 
There's Lois PV up on the screen, and I'm going to kick this back over to uh, Michelle. Okay, so um, I the last person I pulled out, I was just researching a little, and um, yeah, I needed to research it a little more because some of them were in the one to three some hundred dollar range. Awesome. So yeah, I don't want to accidentally give it away for you know twenty dollars. So I am going to, um, if you don't mind, I'm going to just kind of recap what I didn't sell. Sure. sure. Okay. Please. All right. So um, we've got the, the Tommy Hilfiger Madra, Madras, Madras print for $20. That is so 80s. That is the 80s vibe right there, Michelle. I would carry this now, though, because I guess I don't care about you know, what do I know about cool? I mean, um, cool. I, mean I know a lot about cool, but I don't know fashion. <laughs> so that's number 44. Okay. Then I've got the um, Franco Sarto wallet, which I will knock off $3 and go $12 for number 33, brand new. Okay. And it's got... You know, both, oh, I should just both open both of them at one time. All that, all that jazz. Okay, so that's brand new, beautiful Franco Sarto. Hey, it's still on number 44 there, Michelle. Sue Golombeski. All right. Thank you, Sue. All right. So then, um, all right. So then the Franco Sarto is $12 and it's number 33. All right, and then the cat, the amazing cat purse, the Chala, uh, is $50. So cute. And inside is super cute, brown with the turquoise. And wait, side pocket, <gasps> secret. Love that. <laughs> oh, I love that. I do too. Just to look at how cute the face is. And then that big old button over there. Oh, I love that. $50, number five. Then you've got your classic, like, nine and company. Like a brick red and gray. Kind of a more traditional structured bag. Nine and company. Um, I'm going to do 15 on that. 15. And that's number 81. And then we got this amazing Lily Bloom. Ah, so good. This is so good. So comfortable. This is so comfortable. And these colors. So good. A ton of different zipper and places to put your things and your whatevers. Look at the little tag. Even that's cute. I don't know. Call me crazy. I like little things like that. And you got your little zipper, you know, opening here and here and then back here. This one is $30. I will do $25. $25 and it's number 57. Her Xanax pouch. Yeah. Her Xanax. So cute. I love and then that. this for your having a, a really fun time night out. You got your purse. I mean, you got your lipstick, your keys, your uh, tampon if you need one. I don't <laughs> know. Your driver's license, a couple, maybe a couple sticks of gum. Tic Tacs, whatever. Um, what else do you carry? Lipstick, I already said, right? And condoms. And you're ready to go. It's by Chinese Laundry, which I think is a nowadays cool brand, isn't it? I don't would think so. I'm going to mark that one down also. $25. And that's number 69. So I marked, I marked down... Three of them. Okay, Michelle, I see Helen for number 51. 
Helen Booty, 51. All right. Oh, no. Wait, 51. Well, that's what she put on there. Uh, I got 51. It was a while ago, so... Helen, is she behind a little? <laughs> I don't party at all, Carrie. Helen, I'm not sure where you're at because number 51 has was sold a while ago. At 57, the red one. Okay, this 81. This one. I bet that's what she meant. Yeah. 81, probably. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, Helen. All right. Good recap, Michelle. Thank you. <laughs> We've got a few left here. So are you ready for us to switch over? Yeah. Okay. I mean, if I, I'll watch the thing and we can switch back if I, you know, okay. I'll say something. Okay. Sounds good. Um, let me fix these banners like you caught me. <laughs> All right. Here we go. You want to do those two together and yeah. these two together and those separate? So we've got a couple left here and just we're going to put a few together and give you a couple of two for deals. Two for one. So two for 15. Okay, so the first one is like your... Typical bears, right from the 80s. So look at those little <laughs> country bears on there. That fabric with the lace with the ribbon pockets. Cute. So, yeah, this one's just a waist one, and it comes down pretty pretty long. It has my knees. It's got two big pockets in the front. There's the lace at the bottom. This one, I'm struggling to get this safety pin out. There we go. Okay, so that's the first one that you're going to get for 15. And then I guess I need to. Oh, here she come. Oh, did she come by there? Yeah. Then, oh, that was cute. That was I guess cute. I guess it's my turn to model. Right. Oh, Laura. <laughs> In my bank outfit here. That one's giving me Mrs. Claus. <laughs> Yeah, it's it's not. It looks a little Christmassy, but it's kind of a maroon color, actually. But in the off season, that's Mrs. Claus in the off season. Yeah, it'd still be cute at Christmas time. And then this one actually has an adjustment on it, right there. The bows in the front with the buttons, and here's the fabric on that one close up. Okay, so you're gonna get this one and the country bears for $15, and we're gonna call this one number 10. 10, two for one, number 10. I think that's a cute little set for the two of them. Miss Lois. Thanks, Lois. Thanks, Lois. Okay. You didn't fold that up good. <laughs> no, I didn't. I'm sorry. You do the other two for one. Okay, this one up here? Yeah, we've got one more two for one. Okay, yeah. One more. There's two little Christmas ones. And they happen to both be bib ones. This one has a really pretty little stripe. And it's got a, all kinds of Christmas stuff on there. A French horn, a teddy bear, a wreath. Um, all that's in the pattern. Let me get up close with the pattern. Right? Yep. Bells. Really cute little pattern. Mm -hmm. It's got white rickrack for the trim across the top of the bib there. And look at that little heart button at the top. So that's super cute. And then this one to go with it it's got the like darker colors. Hold on, paper clip again. <laughs> paper clipped her little straps so they would fold evenly. Okay, this one's got presents and ornaments and stuff like that. Does it have one pocket? I'm looking from the back. Yeah, one big pocket. So cute. 
with the ornament. Oh, now I see it. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you're getting both of these. Both of them. Yep. Both of them for 15. And it is number five. Number five for these two. Why do I feel like I'm looking at Christmas pumpkins? <laughs> Those big bowls, whatever they are, ornaments or whatever they are, they do look like pumpkins. <laughs> okay, I have got Lois again. Lois Peavy. Lois, you are really taking advantage of this $5 shipping, girl. You're on it. <laughs> Congratulations. So cute. Okay, let me write this down. Okay. Yep. I All love right. that one. This one, yeah. This is fat bird colors. One of the fat bird colors. <laughs> so it is orange check-in. Don't say check-in. <laughs> ah, and it has the bib and everything with this one. I said, I said it was a waste one on my note, but it's not. Look, I must have had it folded under. It's a bib one. And it's got two big pockets. And all you need is something cute and blue to go with it, and you're got all I have a feeling Liz, uh, Lois is doing uh, some shopping because she, she buys a lot of things for her sisters for my sales. I send to her sisters. I, she's buying for her sisters and her friends. She's a very generous lady. That is so awesome. Now, I need to make a disclosure. This one is really big. Yeah. So, yeah. You're going to have on, to You're gonna have to do some tank. Get on some cleavage action. <laughs> yeah. So, you're going to have to do <laughs> some tank with this one. This one was made really big. Really long straps. So, yeah, you're going to need to tailor this one a little bit. But that's for the days that grandma's not wearing a bra. <laughs> May drop. I love the orange. It's kind of like a corally orange uh, check, which is really cute. It's really like vibrant and like fresh looking to me. I like it for like summer. Oh, yeah. Oh, somebody said maybe it's for a man. It's true. Okay. That, that could be it. Maybe. I don't know. But $15 number two. <laughs> and it's not a waste one. It is a bib one. I'll cover that up. $15 number two. <laughs> for the orange check. Jamie doesn't think she's got enough side boob to support that one. <laughs> but Jamie, what if you lay down? Then you have to go to the side. <laughs> oh my gosh. Thank you, Christy <laughs> Thanks, Allen. Christy. <laughs> Wait, will it fit Blake? I want to see this. Christy Allen, you got it. <laughs> okay, we have three more. We've got two more over yep. here, and then we're going to end with this one behind us. These two are almost. They, oh they, wait! Oh, we have four more. Don't well, we? we'll put these two. Together. Okay. Okay. Like that. Okay. All right. There's a little Christmassy one right here. Another Christmas. It's fancy though. It's for your Chris. It's for your fancy Christmas. Oh my! Yeah, look at that like sparkly thread in there too. That looks like it would be a table runner. It really does. Or a tablecloth. And this one's pleated, right? It's pleated and it has one pocket. No, it has two. It has two pockets. Look, with the gold rickrack. Oh, very nice. <laughs> two pockets. And this is a this is a good size one too. I mean, I'm a pretty big girl, and these are pretty much all fit in me pretty well. Yeah, they're all they're all a really great size. Fifteen dollars number, number 12. twelve. And I just, can I just say to everybody, anybody interested in vintage purses, I do have more purses in here. I have some vintage ones and I have one really amazing one with a Lucite handle. And then I, I forgot about this other one I had that's so cute. Ah, it's so cute. Sandra K, we got you. So I will have other purses. Um, they might be in a Tuesday sale where... Um, you know, because I can put the vintage in there or in one of my regular sales. Awesome. awesome. If people are interested, they can email me. Perfect. All right. Thanks, Sandra K. Okay. We have two more. Yeah. Right? I didn't three. Know, yeah. There's three more. We'll put two of them together. How's that? Okay. So that we'll just have two more items. Okay. To sell. 
So this one is kind of similar to the one before it. So this is going to be a two for one? Yeah, these were stacked on top of each other. I didn't really realize they're they're pretty similar to each other. They're not exact though. Okay, so here's another one with the sparkly thread in the pocket, two pockets. And then to go with that, I love this one. This one's just solid red, but the it's got kind of a, I don't know what you call that. It's not really embossed. I think it's roses. There's roses in there. I don't know if you guys can see that through the camera. It's almost like a damask. And it's in... And it's thicker, like a tablecloth kind of material, too. Right. Oh, there, I'm kind of getting it there. Yeah. So there's some um, roses in there. Oh, I do like the pockets. I like the pockets on the one that uh, Mary Beth has on. Oh, yeah. I don't think the red one does not have pockets, I don't think. Here, do I need to model this? One? Yeah. <laughs> okay. This is our last two for one, by the way. Oh, yeah. Look at it us. Looks, it looks funny with my jacket, though. But that's cute. Okay, so you're gonna get both of these for 15 and they're number 25. Number 25, two for one. That one really, really goes with the Alice in Chains shirt, actually. <laughs> <laughs> that one, yeah, you, you nailed it with that one. <laughs> what was the number? Okay, so like 11. Mm -hmm. okay. And it looks like we have Sandra K. Again, thanks Sandra. So I'm going to write that down. And now we've got this real pretty, this last little pretty vintage one. Uh, that was a bit, bit behind us up here. I love this one. Yeah, we saved our favorite for last. I said pansy, but they're violets. I wrote violet. <laughs> You're right. That's... Okay, so this is just another little waste apron but you can tell that this one's not only not only is it vintage fabric it is vintage i think it was made you know in the 50s or 60s now this one has a little bit of damage here this is um pulled away just a little bit but it, the, it's got the little violets on the pocket and that's then really cute. look at that little embellishments i guess that's rickrack it's kind of smaller than the other rickrack this would be a cute display one Michelle, oh, yeah. just like, you know, like Michelle, you said, yeah, you know, in your kitchen. That's that pocket alone is everything. So mm -hmm. this one does, a lot of those um, that we showed have just, were just like made and then put up. This one you can tell is, is a little bit more worn. Uh-huh. Yeah. So cute. And it's older. Oh, yeah. And look at that teeny tiny rickrack for the trim. Yeah, isn't, isn't that, that great? Yeah. Oh, so the violet pocket little display of the little vintage apron 31 number, number 31, 31. $15 ah, I dropped it number 31 on on our last apron hi Polly's projects all right I see Sandra K again Great. Sandra K also taking advantage of that five dollar shipping. Absolutely, she is down for it. Here for it. Okay, guys, that does it for our um little bit here. So remember, if you if you were a winner uh, with us tonight, make sure that you send us an email, uh, fatbirdfinds at gmail .com. We need your YouTube name and your real name. We need your mailing address and we need your PayPal email address. Also. If you purchased from Michelle, make sure that you send her an email, comfycozyliving at gmail.com. And send me all the same information. <laughs> if you're interested, I still have the turquoise cat purse, the gold uh, night out purse, the pretty colors uh, lily bloom purse, and the silver Franco Sarto wallet available. And you can uh, reach out to me either uh, through Instagram chat or or by um, email. And um, also, I just want to say that I have extremely enjoyed seeing Mary Beth's domestic side today. 
Oh yeah. <laughs> it has been my greatest pleasure to watch you just, just rock all of those aprons. I'm, oh, I'm yeah. so happy to have given you that. I can't believe we didn't keep any of those. Right? Oh, just well. for you to use. Oh, that reminds me. I was going to ask them about those silly smocks, if anybody wanted those. Oh, I forgot about those. Do you remember smocks, Michelle? I'm going to yeah. show them really quick. I wish I didn't, but I do. <laughs> I'm going to, I'm. if nobody's interested in them, if, if somebody's interested, I'll sell them all together as one big lot. Okay. And if not, we'll just get rid of them. Okay. Okay. Are they, well, yeah, I got to see. I mean, because we, you know, we used to wear them for like painting or. So that's what I'm thinking. I thought well, somebody might want them to, for crafting, you know, to, to use while they're painting. I'm wearing aprons, that on. aprons, full size aprons when I do my stuff. Do you? Oh, hey. why didn't you sell those? I've sold those. Have you? I didn't think yeah. anybody would want those. Look at this. Oh. That's a good one. Oh, God. I feel, I feel like you're a Mater D or something. I'm, I'm in for this. Look, look at that paisley pattern. I sold stuff like that. I've, seen, like, I've sold like some floral ones, flower power looking ones. This one's got like the little slit what? up the side. I am here woo. for you. Woo, woo. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I like how it, it's a really hard line above your chest, so it kind of distract, detracts from the fact that you have boobs. <laughs> so here's one. How much do you want to sell these for? Just in a lot? Does anybody want to buy it? Somebody They're said awesome. people will buy those. Here's That's one with amazing. a sunbonnet Sue. Does the tag on that one say large? This one says yeah. large. I think they that all are. Like same. 10 or 12 bucks a piece. Okay, we'll do, what should I say? Oh, good for gardening, yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Well, we are getting a storm. So we'll do Oh, that one's amazing. <laughs> what do you wanna do? Just 10 bucks a piece. $10 yeah. a piece. And still the same thing, $5. I wanna see that on you, girl. Oh, she wants you to put that one on. Okay, <laughs> I have to unbutton it. Again, I don't think these have ever been worn either. They I feel so. brand new. Are they buttons or do they have the snaps? Snaps. They're snaps. Those, oh, yes. <laughs> Are like they the pearly kind? The, no, they're the regular oh. kind of snaps. This one's a little too small for me. <laughs> but you get the idea. Oh, come on. Try. Suck it in. <laughs> Suck it in. <laughs> okay. I don't have a... Thing to hold up for numbers. Here, I'll, I'll you just make up a number. Just yep. say it. People, okay. know. I don't ever use anything to write it down. Okay. So the yellow one with the daisies, uh, ten bucks. Number fifty-two. So that's I love that, and that's probably what is is medium or large. Oh, large. They, they say large. Okay. 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 Let's move on. Yeah, maybe nobody wants the daisy one. I think Lois, Lois, are you trying to say that you want Sunbonnet Sue for ten dollars? Okay, is here's this. Is this Sunbonnet Sue? Yeah. Should I give her a number? Yeah. For ten dollars, number uh, sixty-eight. Number sixty-eight. 68 and it says large. Yeah, the color on that trim is great. Yeah. Turquoisey. Okay. There we go. All right, Lois, you got it. This one has little birds on it. Aww. Little chickadees. Which is kind of cute, right? Yeah. Is it? <laughs> Wait, does that one button? I can't see. Yeah, there's buttons or snaps. They have snaps too. Oh no, I see it. I'm looking I first when I look on my phone I can't see it, but then I yeah, looked on it. little snaps. So this one is um 
Number 55. You're going to be the gardening sensation of the neighborhood if you wear that one. <laughs> well, a chickadee might land on your shoulder. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> she heard, is it? Is it? <laughs> Let's do that one. This one? Yeah, I like this. I like the material. Yeah. On this one. Okay. Okay. So last one that we're going to do is this smock with the really cool paisley pattern. Even if you wanted that to like cut up and use the fabric, that's really cool fabric. Yeah. So we're going to say that this is $10, number 99. You could make a, a regular waist apron out of that. Yeah. True. All right. <laughs> the ham pattern. <laughs> it's All not right. ham. It's not ham, Carrie. All right. All right. Good job, Laura. Okay. Good job, Ada. Well done. All right, guys. You did it. We did it together. What a great day. Michelle, is so much fun. It was a good time. It was. Michelle, thanks for joining us. I'm always happy to join you guys. I wish I was there to join you in person. Yes. Hey, just out of curiosity in the chat, guys, I want to know if any of you guys are coming or going to Jeffrey's pop-up event on the 15th and 16th of May. Just out of curiosity, I just would like to know if you're going. I wish I could, because but our my favorite flea market is on that Sunday the 16th. Is it? Yeah. yeah just I mean, it's not the worst drive for me. It would be a long drive, but it wouldn't be the worst. Right. It would be kind of long for you, wouldn't it, Michelle? Yeah. Let's see. Jamie, <laughs> I am with an airplane. What? There she is. I am making it happen. <laughs> she is not, though. I know she's full of hot air. <laughs> I'm going to extravaganza to see George. Cool. Oh, that's fun. Where is extravaganza? I don't know. I'm going in September. So the, are you guys going to go the September one? I don't know. I we am. We haven't talked about that yet. She is what now? <laughs> she is what? She better stop. Jamie. I thought she said she was going to Arkansas in October. Cindy, Cindy, I don't I know. Want to. You should. You should go. We're going to try to go. That's the plan. Well, yeah. I'm Thanks. telling you right now, don't mess with me, Jamie. You're my other half. <laughs> Karen Radford. You're going to be in Mayfield? Yeah, that's not too bad of a drive for you. Karen. When is Karen? Karen's going to be in Mayfield. Yeah. Karen, we need to get together. Let's make that happen because Mayfield's only like 30 minutes away. Put that up there. See, you are not even. Where are you flying into? I want to know where you're flying into. Right now, you tell me where you're flying into. Liar, liar. <laughs> What's boot up there now? DJ Bailey is yeah, in Boots up there eating. <laughs> He's like perfectly in frame above my shoulder back here. Shut up! Are you kidding? Is she kidding? Oh, oh. I don't think she's kidding. Well, I'm not going <laughs> to sleep that night then. I'm coming. I'll sleep in my freaking car. <laughs> oh, so I, I, we're talk, I'm, you, you know I'm going to fire up that Marco Polo as soon as I'm done with this. <laughs> so um, Laura and I are going to try to make it, but I don't know what day because I don't know Laura's work schedule yet. We need a Marco Polo with Jamie. Jamie, you need to send your phone number on Instagram. Maybe I'm Marco Polo more with her son than her. <laughs> Would she oh, do you have her on Marco Polo? Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Maybe. I don't do it a lot, but I like I said, I usually do it with her son more than anything. <laughs> Sandra K, I'm going to be there. Awesome. Awesome. This was the best way to tell you. She is lying. <laughs> <laughs> she was having like a, a I'm too old for this. 
<laughs> this is the big one, Elizabeth. <laughs> I'm coming to join you, honey. I'm coming, <laughs> Elizabeth. <sighs> you probably don't, don't even get that one, do you? No, I know what that oh. is. What is it? Oh, see. Don't say it. <laughs> oh, you already said it, but I was going to say it with you. Sanford and Son. <laughs> it's my ringtone. Is what it is. Got me demonetized on my Easter, uh, Easter window decor because my I I stepped away long enough that my phone rang and I didn't get to shut it off fast enough that the it rang and I got oh. demonetized for that video. Are you kidding me? Just <laughs> that wow, my brother. We we used to Look the actual. When, when we would go out and my grandmother, my grandmother would buy all these big, you know, auction lots of things. Um, my granddad had fixed his pickup truck and he put cattle racks on the pickup truck so that he could stack all the way up and tie it off. And my brother and I were mortified. He used to say, <laughs> looks like something off of Sanford and Sons. Well, I can't get in this truck. <laughs> Cindy Sanders Stone says, okay, explain Marco Polo. So basically it's like text but with video. So you just text back and forth, but like I'll send Michelle like a video, like, hey, Michelle, good morning. How are you? And then she'll see Is that. Is that really how it goes? Can, uh... <laughs> hey, Michelle, good morning. How are you? I don't recall ever getting one of those from MB. No. Stop. <laughs> That's what I get from love. Wait, yeah. Hi, Michelle. Yeah. Happy sale day. <clears throat> yep. Hey, Michelle. Good morning. I hope you're doing good. Oh. Okay, bye. <laughs> there you go. Oh, this is what I get. Michelle. Michelle! Wait, unless it's after a long night of flipping and sipping, then it's Michelle! <laughs> Nobody's talking to me. Everybody falls asleep after flipping and sipping. <laughs> Laura Lee. She's mad at me. Boo won't talk to me. Laura will. <laughs> Nikki won't make me another drink. Nikki's always asleep. <laughs> Oh, that's so funny. Uh, hey, Kim. Oh, oh gosh. Adding, you need to add me, me to your next Marco Polo with Jamie. Is it is that right? And then I can get her Marco Polo? Whatever. Probably Jamie just needs to like send you her phone number, but she doesn't want to talk to you. Oh. Great. <laughs> well, forgive it then. Okay, guys. So if you're not subscribed to Michelle, if you're not subscribed to Michelle, make sure that you do that because Michelle is awesome. Michelle's our bestie. Man, forget it then. Just reminded me. You want me to tell you a quick bank story? Sure. From today? Or should I tell it tomorrow night? Well, I'll just tell it today. How much money did you count today? A lot. <laughs> but today this guy comes in and he says, hello, ma'am. Um, I need to buy a big bag of unrolled pennies, $50 worth. And I was like, I mean, that's the way we sell them to the Fed, but we don't sell them to people like that. And I was like, um, I was like, no, we can't do that. We don't have that. And he and he said, all right, well, then I'll buy them rolled. And I was like, I was like well, okay. I said, are you a customer here at the bank? And he said, he said, no, I'm not a customer at any bank. And I said. Oh, well, I'm so sorry. We won't be able to do that for you. And he goes, what? <laughs> what? You're, you're not going to take my money? And I said, I'm sorry, sir. It's just bank policy. We don't exchange money with people that are not customers here at the bank. And he was like, well, I think it's a federal law. You have to take my money. <laughs> <laughs> you're not really taking money. Anyhow, you're exchanging it. Yeah. He said, isn't it? Isn't that a law? And I said, I don't think so, sir. <laughs> and he said, <laughs> he goes, well, fine. Just forget it then. I'll find somebody else to take my money. Oh, and he left. You know what? It's a good thing you got off of work early because he might have been out at that parking lot at 5 o'clock waiting <laughs> on you. 
<laughs> so you can't change money for anybody or just like coin change? Well, we're not supposed to exchange money with non-customers because what if you make a mistake or what if it's there's something wrong? Right. With it or, yeah. Interesting. I, mean, I want to know what he was going to do with a sack of $50 in pennies. Really? I know. Right? What does that look like? What does it, it look like? How big would that be? Well, you know what a, you know how big a feed sack is? Yeah. The feed sack, it's about that big full of pennies. Oh my God. How much is that weight? How would he even? You, <laughs> you can't hardly lift it. It's all I can do to lift it up by the corners and just kind of set it over on a cart. It's great. I never. I can't, I, I can't believe even that exists. Like, cause you know, you hear about like how pennies are going to be like extinct or something. I can't even picture a I bag know. of pennies that big. I know. Wow. <laughs> you won't take my money. <laughs> a bag of <laughs> Oh my God. That's hilarious. <laughs> Okay, friends, we're going to wrap this up. Michelle, thank you again for joining us. It's been awesome. Any time. Uh, I hope I that you have been have... like, sipping some time. It's been a yeah. while. Yeah, definitely. I hope that all of you guys have an awesome rest of the week. Laura, when do you plan on doing these invoices? In the next day or two? Yep. Okay, so Laura's going to do invoices in the next day or two. We probably will pack everything up and ship with our uh, Friday uh, at Bird 5 things that will happen tomorrow. Yeah. So if you're not familiar, we do flipping and sipping um, tomorrow night at nine central. We'll do our fat bird five. We'll sell five items. We might sell a bonus. You never know. Yep. And I'll be yep. shipping tomorrow. Awesome. Michelle is shipping tomorrow. Well done. Somebody better um, Instagram Michelle about that cat purse. You're missing out. <laughs> All right, guys, make sure you like this video, subscribe to Michelle, subscribe to us if you haven't already. Um, leave us a comment after this video posts if you want to, and make sure you stay tuned to see what Fat Bird finds. Fat Bird finds. <laughs> see you next time. Bye, everybody.